How you doing, Zukazu? Oh, hello, friends! Zukazu moved here since we last met. That Ernest guy, he's a bit of a liar. Nice guy at heart, though. Zukazu can vouch for that. So we get an update to the affinity chart. Zukazu did finally get his first link? No, he had some links before. Uh, it is... No, Zukazu... Right, Zukazu with Ernest. So, two of a kind between Zukazu and Ernest here. Zukazu found out why Ernest is big liar. Someone tricked him and his friend, and his friend died. That liar evil. Zukazu will never forgive them. Uh, maybe another one? Or is it just Ernest again? Ernest told Zukazu what you did. Friends helped him get his own back. You really great people. You, his own back, sure. Let's keep being nice to him. Sure, we will continue being nice to him. You know what, one more time. Maybe, maybe it hasn't looped yet. Yeah, now it has looped. Okay, so that was everything. Let's head. Well, we'll talk to you. What am I doing here? I have lost so many friends. My house, my home. I feel so helpless. Do you know Frontier Village? I've heard that there are some of my people there. Although that is nothing to do with me. Hi there. It is important to just live your life the way you want to live it. I just want to spend my time looking at the stars like this. At least until we have peace and the healing process can begin. Sure. Ha happy things. Eh. Uh, uh. Let's move on. <laughs> Nobody is happy. Elior. I wonder how Muriel and Kalika are doing. They always helped me in achieving my goals. I just hope they're both okay. Once again, I was told you had affinity, but it's just not working out. Thank you so much for delivering those provisions. A thank you letter arrived. It says they were on the point of starvation. The provisions will have brought a little happiness into their lives. Hooray. Sometimes I go out searching for things to use for food. Usually I can only find enough to cook a meal for myself. Those amateur adventurer classes I took really have come in handy. Oh, that's because I just changed it to midnight. So he did have the new thing to say the third time. But still nothing. Nothing in terms of affinity, at least. So we're still just, you know, kind of hoping that I, I got that wrong, or the wiki got it wrong, because the wiki said, yeah, it works out just fine. But there's a few affinity things that I could not get that were on the wiki. What is it? I have heard that my friends are in a place called Satoral, but I doubt that place is as safe as it is here. I hope they have found some happiness there. What is it? They must be short of food. A scientist friend told me that there is not much to eat in Satoral. How terrible to starve to death after all that happened. As you can see, our lives have reached rock bottom. In Alchemoth, we had food, clothes, everything we needed. Here, we struggle even to forage for fruit. Well? I want to survive and return to Alchemoth. I think everyone else here feels the same. We are all one people, and we have few friends here. I hope we can all work together and live in peace. We're not checking the shop, but we will check with you. I think there are people trying to help those who became Telethia. I heard they are in Satoral Marsh. They are truly great people. Why would they be doing that? If only I was as considerate as those people. But I just cannot get into the habit of being considerate to others. But I've been given another chance. Maybe I can change. Maybe. Probably not. I know you high end here too well. Now who's being racist? Alright, so that is it for the refugee camp. So let's move on. Uh, still in... Uh, the Bionis' leg, right? Nothing, 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 nothing. I'm just kind of double checking that there's no people in any of these places. There are not. So let's head up to, uh, we'll start the Spiral Valley and then we'll head over to the Traveler's Rest. Gonzalez? No Gonzalez. Wow. I know sometimes it takes a little bit for people to come back, but like I've never seen Gonzalez not there. It's so weird. All right, so we need to go over to the Traveler's Rest. We need to try to get cheerier things happening for us. That's the way I'm looking at it. I want people to be happier than they are. It's not working out really as well as I would like. But eventually, people will be happy somewhere. 
well, maybe everywhere after I do all the things that I'm supposed to do, but, you know, this is the last time that I'll get a chance to talk to these people. They won't have anything more to say about plot after I've won, because then the game kind of either starts over or is over. So I don't have too many options when it comes to talking to people. I'll, I'll, I'll be right back. Okay. Garugu? Garugu, so happy you go and find Batu, 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 promised Garugu he never wander off alone again. Garugu, so happy now. Garugu never ever lose Batu, Batu again. If Garugu lose Batu, Batu, that make Garugu liar. This is the same thing you said before. Batu, Batu, never wander off alone again. Batu, Batu, sorry for causing trouble for everyone. Batu, Batu, also promised Garugu. Anything else? Batu, Batu, never make trouble for you again. Batu, Batu, think before he acts next time. Now Batu Batu always tell Garugu before he goes out. Alright, well, that was a bit of a run for nothing, so let's head out once more. We're going to head back to Colony 6. Yeah, a little bit of work here. I was thinking maybe that I had hit my time, but not quite yet. So, we are going to talk to a few people here in uh, Colony 6. We're also going to get some of those damn collectibles because I can Boom, all mine. All mine. All right, let's talk to people. Yes. You're here. You guys are one of a kind. You rebuild the colony, tons of people come back. Now we've got loads of people from all over Bionis. Yes. When I got here, there weren't that many people. Now there are so many people we can't all fit in the assembly hall. At least you guys are taking part of local politics. Well. You remember how I was saying I wanted some more shops? Well, there's way too many now. I have to figure out which place has the best stuff. When did I get so spoiled? Well, spoiled. There's one shop I haven't got around to visiting yet. It's only open from three in the morning till six. You can forget about me getting up before 10, or maybe someone can come and wake me up. Hi there. To think that we high Antia would end up like that. No, we must not dwell on this because we have been welcomed with open arms by the, the Hans here. The other residents here have made it easy to adjust. The Hyantia are able to live here quite sufficiently. I do worry about my brethren who fled to other areas of Bionis. They're fine-ish. Uh, you don't have anything to say now, Juju, do you? Can you give me a hint? Restoration complete! Alright, let's talk about this. I don't think I've ever seen this. It's amazing! It's much livelier than before! I never thought I'd see all those- all these different peoples living together! Thanks for all the hard work! Let's- let's listen to more things! Fully populated! Finally, all houses are occupied! The only people we should be getting now are visitors! It's great that so many people believe in this colony! Alright! So we get some things here. Housing is done! We've built all the houses we can! That wraps up the reconstruction of the colony's housing. Good job, guys. Thank you. I did most of the work. Well, not really. They kind of just stretch things really well. That's it. The commerce can't get any better than this. Everyone in the colony has been telling me how much they love it. All right. Now we have nature. The ether mine's up and running. The ether crystals we harvest here are the best on Bionis. Why don't you go and take a look? I don't have any room for it, actually. I need to do some gem crafting just to make room. Uh, special is complete. We finally finished building our defense facilities. Now we can hold off any enemy. Except Telethia, maybe. Uh, anything else? Uh, level 5 complete is the last one here. That's all the facilities finished. I bet the colony looks amazing from up above. Go take a look. It was a lot of hard work, but seeing this makes it all worth it. We did it! We are done with Colony 6. The colony is fully restored. I joined the reconstruction efforts much later after it started, but I imagine it was a long road. Finally, we can enjoy its revival. If possible, I would love to see a statue erected in your honor. Your achievements through all this should not go unrecognized. No, it shouldn't. You guys should bow down and start worshipping me. Poke Boca! Do not remind me of Hoko's food right now! Then again, I wants to eat it. Mm, how strange, maybe it his secret ingredient? 
The record-breaking Colony 6 restaurant rivalry is all but over. Talon is won by miles. I feel sorry for Hoko. But I have an announcement. I will be a cook and start my own place. That's nice. Nature has been fully restored. Thank you for all your hard work. I hear the ether crystals collected from Colony 6 are purer now. Why not visit the ether mine and look for some? I will, eventually. That's all you have to say, that one thing. No, what? The other person, talk to the other person. Thank you. All the houses are finished, who would have thought it? There's more people and it feels like a proper colony. I'm relieved. All the houses are finished, who would have thought it? Yeah, that's that's the same thing. All right, let's talk to Talonith here. You will not find better food anywhere else, I assure you. What is it? I pay no heed to my rival's flavors. I must continue with my own brand of cookery. We are as different as the night is to the day. He's also a little bit poetic. Yay! Yay! Now Hoko's food tastes like sweaty feet socks. Why? And smelly smell from restaurants stink like stinky stink. Friends call this pollution? A little bit, yeah. Why does one bird girl keep going back every day? I think her tongue stopped working. She eat yak yak food so much her birdie taste buds died. Entirely possible. I hear him McCrish. When different peoples clash, you get unique problems, but we should never choose sides. We should strive to achieve equality in everyday life. Sure. It's great to have a bit of rivalry when it serves a purpose. Just as long as we all treat each other equally. It's been a while since leaving Alchemoth where I had family. One of these things is not like the other. Boring! Hoko bored today! Hoko bored of making food for same person every day. Bird girl must have strange tongues to like Hoko's food. That's- you just say the one thing, Hoko? After all I did for you, you can't even think of a second thing to say. How you doing, Satata? I was told my watchtower wasn't sufficient protection. That's why my new gun battery will blow them away, get it? I never thought my Grampy Pawn inventor brain would be so useful. Everyone thanks me for my work and all Na Pawn can get used to this. I hope it was all worth it. How you doing, resident? They finished the gun battery. It took some work, but it's done. You think it'll hold off any attack on the colony? We can't afford to let all this hard work go to waste again. Colony 6 needs to defend itself. But all the people of Bionis are mucking in. It'll work for sure. Wait, was that a person over there? Yes, it was! Reconstructing Colony 6 sounds like a lot of work. They don't have the materials they need around here. No need to panic, it'll take time, but it'll all come together. It did. If you can't find the materials you need, why not trade for them? Find people who have what you want, and before you know it, you'll have everything you need. It did. I hate you for not knowing that already. Let's head up to the top of the gun battery here. I help out the defense force. I'm learning to be guard person. If I find funny looking person, I start shouting, Mwah! That'll help. Do friends know Napon can work here too? Very good for Napon. I learned structure of Hom Hom defense force to help Napon. Now Napon can make force and share power with Hom Hom. I mean, that's a roundabout way of talking about it, but yes, that is accurate. Hey, look, an Angel Engine X. And an Art Core Coil. I needed those for different things. Parts Noble, I think, is a good trade. I forget. Oh, Moss Panel, I don't think, is good. Have you heard the latest rumor? I mean, Leader is the new Lieutenant Colonel. I returned to Colony 9 the other day. She looked ravishing. I'd like to see her pull off that ensemble and save the day. Ha! Oh, what? What's with all this competition for positions in the defense force? Little rivalries become fierce rivalries. It's a never ending battle. If only everyone was a little bit more like me, carefree and happy, then we'd achieve world peace. Yeah, that's the secret. What's up? Guess I was wrong about Nick. Saw him the other day and he had this fearless look to him. I guess new challenges can really bring out the best in us. What's up? That's who it was, Nick. I was thinking of that. That Monopon master of Nick's is something else, incredible even. A lot has to. A lot has got to do with Nick's work ethic. He trained hard. He should go back to Colony 9 and show them how good he's got. Nah, he's, he's good here. I've come from Colony 9 to give some moral support. There's quite a few districts back at Colony 9 and there's tension. 
But here I can see you're all pulling together as one. It's great. They've got nearly everything they need here, but one thing. An evacuation zone. There's the cliff behind the colony, and the dome only has one exit. Any attack would pin people back, and that's not good at all. He's got a point. If they try to storm the main entrance of Colony 6, there's really nowhere for anybody to run to. Did not think of that until he said it. How you doing, Kuroki? Wow, friends the best. Everything restored now. Kuroki and Grampy Pond not believe are not upon eyes. Tell Kuroki about time friends fought with Big Fat Dragon. Kuroki loves scary and exciting tales of hero friends. Will you tell Kuroki? Nope. We're moving on. Because that's all he has to say. Alright, there should... Yeah, I thought I saw somebody down here. Me learn something important. Sometimes it's hard to find items needed for reconstruction. But friends should not worry or panic. Not good for heart. Friends should take their time and not rush things. Now me see more green things. Me happy happy. Nature is good for heart and good for soul. Me realize Nopon need to live near nature to be happy. Me start my own garden soon. What flowers should me choose? Uh, any of them should be fine, I would think. Alright, uh, nobody here. Uh, let's change the time and we'll kind of work back from here. We'll make it, uh, 2300 hours. That sounds good. Wait. Wait, yep, there was somebody here. Me got free biscuit from Warner Biscuit Man. Now me not have to eat leaves and twigs anymore. <laughs> it was it was one or the other, apparently. Last week me eat flowers, then butterflies stopped coming. That was you? Me feel very guilty. As long as me get biscuit, me promise not to do it again. Damn you, flower eater. Alright, let's see. Nobody here. Let's head up. And then... Well, actually, there's some people here. They made a fountain for me. As a thank you to Little Pond friends, me give you sage advice. Oh, ho, ho. wait here, Little Pond. Yeah. What's the advice? At Frontier Village's diving board, friends might learn new power. Well, that was good advice, like a hundred parts ago. I see the butterflies are back. Without them, that garden was just another garden to me. And who got them back? Not that guy, but the Naw Pond. We'll have to do the Nopon a big favor to say thanks. All for one and one for all, you know what I'm talking about. Except you're still separating people. Just saying. Me smell Nopon sage coming from friends' bodies. Me never smell such divine smell. Friends going to tell me Nopon sage real next. Bah! Get out of here. Me not believe it for a second. You, you smell it, though. Me want to meet with Nopon sage. Me ask him to make fur into colors of rainbow. I don't think that's how it works. Here at last. The reconstruction is complete. Think of all the efforts we had to go through just to finish it. It's amazing. Truly amazing. Can you remember what this place used to look like? A wasteland. Now look. It's a paradise in comparison. I will never underestimate the power of the people's spirit again. And we all teamed up for this one. Mostly me. I mean, mostly all of us. I did the majority of the work. We're going to head up here and see if there are still people. Oh. Me, I've seen lots of things. Good folk, bad folk, all folks. Wherever me go, me feel the same. But not here. All friends, good people and nice. Everyone have big hearts. Yes. Me decided me live here forever and ever. It not matter if times are good or bad. Me stay with friends here. There is that heart to heart. We will take care of that when we do heart to hearts. I'm a Machina, but don't know as much about machines as some. Even so, I hope my skills have come into good use here. Hi there. Hi there. My neighbors don't mind living next to a machine at all. It's great. We might look different, but we're all on the same page. You know what I mean, right? We gotta stick together. Greetings. So they've got miniature ether plants in this colony, hey? What were they called? Oh, that's right, ether planters. I never knew the Homs had such technology at their disposal. You learn something new every day, don't you? Greetings. Because they are small, the ether planters are used everywhere. That way they collect ether from a wide area. Our ether plants at Earth, Earth Sea might be huge in comparison, but I don't think it can collect from as wide as er, uh, an area as the planters. So, technically the Homs have a better ether plant than the Hyentia do. 
That's an interesting kind of thing to point out. But it's only in Colony 6, and only because of the work that I did. So I'm better than the high end here, is what I'm saying. Can you believe it? The reconstruction is really complete. Was it you who got all these people to come and live here? I think everyone is really happy they decided to live in the colony. What is it? I know this place isn't for everyone, but life has to go on, you know? So don't you worry about it. You do what you have to. Anybody left over here? Oh, yeah. Olga's here. Garmin told me how overjoyed he is at our new colony. Better than ever, he said. I have to agree. I love it. Yeah. We're not young anymore, but seeing the colony like this. Oh, it makes me feel so young. Thank you so much. And nobody here. Somebody hanging out on the sides. Uh, shouldn't Gorman be here? How you doing, Gorman? The colony has more residents now than it ever had before. I opened my front door today and almost died of fright at the people. Who's this? How will we ever repay you? We have volunteers sprouting up on every street corner. We are very grateful for all your efforts. Hooray, I did a thing. And people are happy. Only took the entirety of the game. All this stuff makes me think. If all these different cultures had got together sooner, would we have got our bums whipped so badly by the Mechon? No. Maybe so many people didn't have to die that day, we'd be happy. So many cultures and so much happiness. Brilliant, eh? Keep this up and the future really does look bright. Hey, this respawned. Someone must have heard me. The colony is greenery again. We can't be happy all day with no trees and flowers to enjoy. Uh, I feel like skipping down the street. Did you know? Bringing back nature to the colony increases ether crystal purity. When the reconstruction is complete, head to the ether mine. It, it is complete. I haven't been back to the ether mine, granted, but it is complete. Last person today, it looks like. You're collecting items for the colony reconstruction, right? Let me give you some advice. Anytime you need something you can't quite find, take a break. Yep, just take a break and chill out. Put your feet up and relax. You can find it later. I, I found all the things, though. When we finish rebuilding, we can put up some street lights. We need to rebuild our homes, shops, and special facilities first. A few lamps here and there will brighten the streets loads. That is true, but it's done. And you guys should all acknowledge that it's done. But now that we have talked to everybody in this kind of Reconstruction HQ section of... Colony 6, that is going to do it for these parts of Let's Play Xenoblade Chronicles. I've been Baller Scoop. I've been joined, as always, by my talkative squad of Ricky, Melia, Shulk, Dunban, Ryan, Fiora, and Sharla. Nobody actually talked today, but we were still quite talkative. Hope you guys have enjoyed these parts. Hope you laughed. Hope you learned. Hope to see you next time. Thanks for watching.